Hi guys, welcome to Office Blokes React. I am Office Bloke Dave. I'm Office Bloke Mike. Office Bloke Dan. Together we all are Office Blokes who drive within the speed limit absolutely all the yep. time, every time. Yep. yep. Prove us wrong. Yep. Well, don't don't challenge people. <laughs> <laughs> Although I did do a speed ahead and scores a few weeks ago. So. Oh, <laughs> never done one, me. <laughs> Have you not? Well, you'd rather take the, the, the points than do the course. I'm sitting on like four or five hour course. Nah, it's all right. Driving insane. I've done it twice. Mm. I've done it in person and then I've done it over Zoom as well. Yeah. And the, the Zoom one's worse, but they're yeah. both equally bad. Yeah, yeah, I thought it was all right, the Zoom one. It's easy enough to do. Oh, it's dead easy. No point. It's just really boring. Yeah. Oh, absolutely. Yeah, it's never going to be exciting or anything. I bet you had to sit that course because that guy at the corner here got you in a 30 yep. zone for doing 34. <laughs> That's the fella. Yep. What were you exactly. doing? Was it 34? It, it was something like that, 34, 35 <laughs> max. Yeah, It's yeah. not even speeding. I'd go I back know. and get him. I know, it's him up. joking it. Yeah. It's, like it's, a gold, it's like a gold mine from there. Yeah, I know. I know. I don't come that way. I go no. through the supermarket instead. I do, so, on the way here, I do, so but I, it, I think this was at lunchtime or uh, something like that. So, yeah. It's just luck of the draw, that, isn't it? Because we've all driven past that little bit yeah. too fast. Everyone's yeah. had one here. Well, I don't think you, you've not, have you? No. I've not. I have luckily seen the cops a couple of times yeah. just in advance mm. and slowed down as yeah. I got to him. Yeah. I've been nearly got one again another time, but I saw it in time because I was aware of it this time. So, mm. you know, it's, uh, yeah. Yeah, it was I, close. Should have outrun him, Mike. <laughs> I don't know how you managed to get caught speeding, Mike, when you weren't even speeding because we'd never break the speed limit. No, I, I think it's. I think the obviously speed gun. The calibration. Like calibrating. Yeah, I, I think there's a, a calibration error. I should have taken them to court for that, but you should. I thought being should. upstanding citizen, so I thought I'd just go with the flow and support the local constabulary. Yeah, fair play. <laughs> Queued up the wrong video. Cheeky cut. You probably didn't notice that. So this is <laughs> seamless. <laughs> Dodge Challenger Hellcat outruns cops and helicopter. In high speed chase, and a helicopter, yeah. and oh. a helicopter. You've got to be good. You've got to be doing something to out, outrun a helicopter. I would have think very, so. very. Yeah, how fast do these bloody cars go? <sighs> got to be doing. They must be, be close to two hundred, aren't they? It's got to be. Aren't you think yeah. a helicopter's like one sixty, one eighty at least? Yeah, you you've think. got to be doing one eighty. I think they cap most cars over here at one hundred and fifty four. Is it? Is that what it is? I think so. Yeah, I think most oh, okay. BMW's top speed is that, but that's yeah. literally because they've capped it. Mm. Yeah, you know, if you take it off, which is bizarre, really. Why would you cap it at one hundred? That's twice the legal speed limit, anyway. Why not? You got to go on track days. Mm. You can't say to people, spend all this money on this car and it only goes up to 70 miles yeah. an hour. No yeah, but why would, it, why would it cap it 154, though? Which is, why not cap it 180? Because that's when you 200. take off 180. That's when you take off. <laughs> it is, yeah. <laughs> uh, well, let's check this out. Dodge Challenger Hellcat outruns cops and helicopter in high-speed chase. Let's wow. do it. There you go, Doug. We got him. You see him right there? They're ahead yeah. of him. <laughs> Coming up. Coming up to I-10 here. What do you reckon he's doing at this point? Been, Probably about uh, a ton. Following this for about the past got to be over a ton. Go and go to speed the other cars. Well, we understand this is a got Dodge Challenger, uh, and it is a Hellcat. 707 horsepower motor in this car. I love how he's giving the stats. way faster than the speed limit here. Uh, this is just oh, a wow. I-10. We're heading eastbound now. And uh, probably about 100 miles an hour or so, if not faster. Yeah, Don, uh, that, police that are car in is pursuit. moving so fast. I'm not getting mixed Midas on my IFB right away. I'm getting feedback, uh, so I'm turning it down. But, Don, that, that vehicle is clearly going at least 110 miles an hour. And, uh, and the police are in pursuit of this. And they lost him for a while because he got so far out in front of them. But the tracker helped them pinpoint exactly where he was. And so they narrowed their focus down. And this chase uh, clearly using the feeder now to side uh, over there on the must be next then if it's got a tracker on it and the cops have got access to it we well, think so wouldn't you yeah i don't know i-10 i think that's when i lived in houston i think the i-10 used to run like across the bottom of the usa yeah i, I-10 used to when i go from houston down to like louisiana and places like with right uh, with head down i-10 i think right you're rolling the dice doing this aren't you it's either get away or you're gonna die that's pretty much it. We yeah. were talking the other day when I was on the um, I was on the motorway going down to London, and uh, we were talking and saying like driving. You know, when you drive in the USA, I mean, look how look how wide them lanes are. Yeah, and how open it is. You know, four three four lanes highway. Yeah, and then I was driving here, and I had a truck right next to me and a barrier to, for roadworks right next, on the other yeah. side of me. Yeah, and it had about eight inches either side, and it was and I was driving like that for a good sixty mile. <clears throat> really? Yeah, and I'm thinking wow. that's the difference driving over here. It's very you need focus 100%. And there's, oh, no straight, there's no straight motorways. No. Yeah. You're not straight neither. Yeah, I get that. Definitely. 
you're right about that. And there's just endless roadworks where mm. nothing seems to be getting done. Yeah. So there's all a the time, closed, just a different type of driving. Very, very absolutely, different. Absolutely, yeah. I can imagine, I mean, year after year, roadworks, we're always moaning about it, but it's just absolutely yeah. constant, isn't yeah. it? It just never seems to end. And you never, but, when you're driving over here, you've never got nothing next to you. No, there's, there's always all, something yeah, next to you. Yeah, there's always traffic. Mm. Yeah. yeah, the idea of you doing, let's say someone doing 100 in lane three in this country, you, uh, you, very quickly you're going to get to a point where there's cars in each lane in yeah, front of you. Absolutely. And you're yeah. going to have to slam yeah. on or try and swerve. Yeah. 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 Disaster waiting to happen, mm. isn't it? Yep. Emergency shoulder trying to get around all of these cars. We're out here at the San Jacinto River heading eastbound on I-10 at a high rate of speed. Well, for fear that I will lose him, uh, I can tell you that there were probably a dozen uh, HPD cars in pursuit. Mm -hmm. and at one point, they got ahead of him because he had made a U-turn, so they were already there. Uh, he passed them, uh, and uh, I do know that there are sheriff's deputies involved in this as well as the HPD. PD chopper, uh, at least one of them in pursuit with us up here uh, with this chase heading eastbound on I-10. How fast are you going, Don? Uh, our current speed is about 100 to 110, so we're kind of keeping up with them. Where that is. Uh, any state troopers? Do you see any state troopers around, Don? Because clearly they're going to have to take control or at least get on this as well because he oh, is way out. outside of even yeah. county boundaries, isn't he? Yes, and I have not seen any state troopers yet. Look at him, look at him now. Look at him leaving. Wow. We did that shift in that. Yeah, wow. An uh, unmarked uh, police vehicle that had its lights on just a moment ago. Okay. Um, I, I'm not exactly sure what they plan on doing and how to bring this uh, to an end. Sooner or later, he's going to have to get off the freeway, I assume. Yeah. Well, and you mentioned that there is a police helicopter following him. Have you been able to see any of the officers in his wake? Uh, I know for a little while they lost him because he was so far out in front. Wow. Yeah. He I thought he hit the kid. Yeah. I thought he hit the kid. We did. Don, oh. we did he? She said he sideswiped the 18-wheeler. Yeah, it did look like it, looked didn't like it? it, didn't it? See any of the officers in his wake? Uh, but I think he could have just gone straight up. Lost him because he was so far out in front. Wow, he just sideswiped. It looked like that uh, eighteen wheeler. Don, wow. you asked you a moment ago. You said you thought you were going about hundred and ten, and you're having trouble on. Well, we are, uh, and uh, and uh, HPD is uh, as well. But thank goodness we've got uh, the doubler on our camera here, so we can take a picture of him from quite a distance. Right. Yeah, we remind the audience that this is not, I mean, he's not right on top of him. Our, our, you know, the pilot, he has this incredible zooming lens that can go all the way into uh, that vehicle that it makes no. it appear that we're right on top, but uh, we're having a tough time keeping up with this guy. And to, and to continue our conversation about our speed, I just checked with uh, Mike Silman, who's uh, at the controls of our uh, Sky Eye helicopter here. We're currently doing... 120 miles an hour, wow. oh, and we're, he is losing. He is losing us. Yeah. Uh, we're we're at the maximum speed right now, but wow. we're going to try wow. to keep with him as long as we can. Uh, but obviously, he still continues to pull ahead. We're going to try to keep up with him as long as we can. Well, I think this is one of the first times where uh, the, the the vehicle has actually outrun the chopper. Yeah. Uh, I, I don't know how other way to put it, but I, I think that's what's happening here because it's it's tough to see him and and. Uh, you could see him right there on the far left. He's right there on the shoulder right now, passing that box truck. Uh, the HPD helicopter has had to pull off because they were running low on fuel. Yeah. So we're okay. up here by ourselves. Okay. Right and he continues to move. Now, keep in mind, this guy is traveling well over 120 miles an hour at some point because our chopper is traveling at a, at a top speed of 120 and we can't keep up. Okay, now on Highway wow. 73, headed to Port Arthur. Um, already driving past Winnie, and he is, I've, you know what, I honestly have lost track of him. He's somewhere over there on the right-hand side. Um, He's gone, isn't he? Yeah. And just moving along at speeds that have been incredibly fast, at 130, possibly 140 at times, and open stretches. Uh, as we look wow. at these pictures, as Art says, he is so far out in front, it's almost uh, hard to keep up with him, and especially as he moves into this very heavily wooded area there, he's disappearing behind Gump. the trees. At, but we've kind of lost him at this point because... Well, he's simply going too fast. Yeah, he really is. HPD helicopter has lost the guy. Wow. wow. That's insane. <laughs> Some of the manoeuvres yeah. he's pulling off there. I'm assuming it's a he. It's all <laughs> it might not be. He's saying women can't drive like that, mate. No, it's just a generic... <laughs> uh, 
way of describing somebody. I mean, absolutely crazy. Yeah, I mean, it's not, not the risk incredible. of his own life, it's risking everyone else. Is it? it's, it's of course, like, it's, that's the worst bit out, isn't it? Just bringing, him, bringing everybody else into it, isn't mm. it? Into the danger. I wonder why they didn't have the, you know, they have those heat signature cameras. Mm. I wonder why they weren't using that because his car is probably bright white compared to everyone else's. Yeah, you could probably just see it. I suppose <clears> daylight, yeah, you know which one it is. That's getting away, though. I mean, if you're going yeah, yeah. to try and catch up. Well, that's a news helicopter. Oh, it is, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. Apart yeah, from anything yeah. else, I mean, I, I don't know how far heat-seeking sort of like a... I think it's goes good. as well. Yeah, yeah. It's yeah, yeah. go for quite a far longer distance yeah. and stuff. Yeah, they're not going to do that on the news. Are they? Won't be new, no, you're news. right. No, they yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah but right. the cops will have it. But, I mean, that guy's gone. It's not great. Well, is it cops have news... to land because they ran out of petrol. Yeah. <laughs> it's not great is that news helicopters got further than the police helicopter. I mean, uh, I, don't know if I, I don't know how long they've been pursuing it, but... It's, yeah. Uh, it's only somebody's... I mean, they may have run out of petrol in the car. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, good at I mean, that speed and yeah. it's only going to go for a certain amount of time. All of a sudden it's just like... Uh, yeah. The next thing, whoop, pop behind you. <laughs> I think those cops are a good five, ten minutes behind him now. They've got more fuel, they're going to catch him, aren't they? Yeah, absolutely, yeah. yeah. They'll be bringing other, other county uh, sheriffs into play there, maybe, yeah. will they? Or, mm. I would guess... I think they crossed state okay. lines, had they? And they were saying state troopers need to be involved yeah. at this point. Yeah. So Is that state, what, state troopers, can they go anywhere? Is that what you mean? Anywhere in the oh, state. So yeah, the, right. The county lines. Yeah, so the county troopers yeah. have pulled county back police. and then the yeah. state troopers took over because they crossed yeah. county lines. Yeah. So state troopers can sort of like... They, they, state ex- troopers normally patrol the highways. Like ah, that right. Thing. Yeah. Right. That's why I've always come across state troopers in anyway. They were the, <laughs> they were the bell end cops. Really? They kept arresting you for speeding. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I told you, have I had, you my ever, P- uh, had my PBA card. Have you ever yeah. driven a... Uh, Hellcat before that. No, <laughs> white one, <laughs> by any chance. <laughs> yeah, every time you dropped a wad of cash on the floor and the state trooper came over and went, oh, shit. They didn't take it kindly, did they? A PBA card, I give him and he just threw it away. <laughs> Ripped it? it up. Oh, man. <laughs> anyway, hope you guys enjoyed that. Don't forget to like and subscribe and we'll catch you on the next one. Cheers, Cheers. guys. Cheers.